Peace be with you. Welcome back to my channel for another video, another intuitive spiritual download. If this is the first time that you're coming across my channel, welcome. Come on in. Listen, tell a friend. Maybe you will decide to like, share, and or subscribe. Nine times out of ten, you're not here by accident. What it is that you need to know is something you already know. Maybe you just need to know the details, right? Sometimes that helps in order to move forward. I support you in that energy. I can totally understand that. Just know that the universe is supporting us all here in spiritual court. If you're returning back to the channel, you are my beautiful, amazing soul tribe family. At least most of you, a great deal of you. And for that, I am eternally grateful. Listen, I need you to know that I know that you know, that you know, I know, you know, the most I knows how much I love you. I love you, Soul Tribe. Hey, I love you, Soul Tribe. Listen, Soul Tribe. Soul Tribe. Listen, let's go ahead and dive right on in. I have already called in my appropriate protection. I pray that you were wise enough to have done the same. Somebody could be an Aries. An Aries could be significant. Let's just get into it. Somebody's lying to about somebody. Okay, somebody's got a lot of responsibilities, something about some money that they owe, or maybe they're just spent by way of the universe. Nevertheless, this says spiritual surveillance, okay? Mm, angels it says that everything that they did everything not one iota okay was overlooked your spirit team saw it and now your spirit team is getting their lick back aries energy might be real significant okay somebody could be uh from uh idaho okay i just heard or georgia i'm getting georgia Okay, Pennsylvania. These are always the ones that come up on, like you see those license plates? You see that PA, Pennsylvania? All right, yeah. Massachusetts. Somebody could be from Massachusetts. Nevertheless, it doesn't matter. Those states could be real significant, but something that somebody did is now being reviewed in spiritual court. Okay, so somebody was under spiritual surveillance. Every move, every deed, every energy, every thought that they sent out to you, everything that they did literally, figuratively, quietly, silently uh, was being seen and or recorded by your spirit team. There's nothing that your spirit team has not found all, out. Excuse me. All has been revealed. <laughs> Okay, so there's nothing that cannot be found out through spirit. Okay, so somebody could have found out something by way of divination. Somebody could speak to spirit. Somebody has a gift to talk to spirit. Okay, something was found out. Okay, but I feel like this is more just in, in general. Yeah, energetically, I can't make it up. Empress energy, Libra energy has been coming out real strong lately. Balance in my own energy, the star energy. Aquarius energy, okay? Yeah, let's just see what's going on. Somebody's in the public eye. Somebody was throwing some nasty-ass energy towards you, okay? Could have been a fire sign. Somebody that has Aries highly aspected in their chart. Or you could be an Aries coming up, you know, as the Aquarius energy. Star-like energy or the Empress. Take what resonates. Who's this Aquarius? Are they on the good side of things? Are they on the good side? Or no, they're not. They're not. They're a nasty little, nasty little energy, like a nasty little, uh, just nasty. Somebody's very promiscuous, okay? Knight of Wands. Somebody could be addicted to pornography, I just heard, okay? Yeah, Nine of Cups. I feel like you're the only one that they can't have, and it's making somebody frustrated. So this Aries is a very promiscuous, uh, you know, when I think of Knight of Wands in the reverse, I think of abuse of power. Somebody could be... Um, have tried to control you with sex ew the empress <laughs> like somebody that really loves himself like okay well i don't know nine of cups they didn't get what they want clarify this energy what is this about strength leo energy yeah somebody wanted to dominate you overpower you domination through sex with that knight of wands in the reverse okay there's nothing that your spirit team did not find out i just heard your spirit team is you know is so tapped in you're so tapped into your spirit team by way of the realms, 
higher realms. You could have new spiritual protectors. These are all knowing omnipresent beings, y'all. Like in real life, there's nothing that they can't find out. So for those people that feel like they still want to work in the dark or they think that nobody's seeing them, your spirit team, excuse me, is seeing every move, every deed, every energy, every thought that's sent out to you and done towards you is being seen and recorded by your spirit team. So just a disclaimer, you know, for those people that still want to play in the spiritual ethers, you about to get that ass spiritually etherally taught a really good lesson. Okay, yeah, the universe is going to whoop somebody's ass in a really good way. It's necessary. You know, I always say by the time it gets to spiritual court, this is a long overdue ass whooping. Okay, mm -hmm. strength. If somebody wanted to overpower you with sex, okay, they got a lot of people that they want to be with. But for some reason, they got a lot of people that they can be with. Okay, but for some reason, they're coming towards this Empress energy. Ace of Cups is reconciliation, the star they could be watching you on TV, on the screen, doing something weird with that Willy Wonkin, Wang Wang. This could be a feminine too, okay? Not a wands is not gender prejudice, but somebody could be watching you, okay? Uh, I don't know. Or maybe they're looking at a video that y'all, you know, did and or had from the past. It doesn't always have to be sexual in nature, but somebody is looking at you uh, by way of video without you, okay? Without your consent. This is not... Yeah, somebody's wanting you. Spiritual surveillance. They want to overpower you, dominate you. Okay, is what I just heard. Yeah, listen, they could have done some type of sex magic, hierophant energy. Somebody's too high ranked for the bullshit. Yeah, here they go. King of Wands. They're not wanting anybody to come towards you. Okay, this King of Wands energy. Now they want to come up as a king. You know why? Because the Knight of Wands is real promiscuous. This person has a lot of sex with a lot of people. But here you are, this empress, this star, this higher font. They want to reconcile with you. Now they want to come up as a king. You know why? Because of the conflict. They know that you are a valuable asset. Somebody is not starved for attention from, from masculine energy, feminine energy. But the reason why they're coming up and getting their shit together is because they're under judgment, just so you know. So that is their incentive. <laughs> Somebody's like, oh, shit, I'm under judgment. I better get my shit together. Well, okay, if that's what inspires you, if that's what's going to encourage you, then so shall it be. <laughs> Let the cards and the chips fall where they may. Somebody's really crazy. Somebody wanted to win at all costs. They did something by way of spiritual work. Okay, this person's at a distance. You could have moved away from this person. Listen, they did something spiritually to keep you bound. Ooh, heavy on the Sagittarius energy. Half man, half amazing, I just heard. Somebody's sex game is no joke. Wherever you are, you're very well endowed. You know how to use your wand, but somebody wanted to control an empress, a star, who's destined, a higher font. They want to reconcile. They tried to control you with sex. The moment you left, the moment you decided to move forward, this really bruised this person's ego. They could have gone on like a sexual rampage, y'all, with that nine of cups and the nine of wands in the reverse with the strength, like finding women that were easy to dominate or finding men that were easily swayed and or seduced to dominate. This was all to validate their existence, validate their power. You know, they needed some type of reassurance. My nose is itching. I know that's the truth. Yeah, listen, this person's sneaky and deceptive, okay? At the end of the day, somebody's really having to face the fact that maybe sex is all they have to offer. Maybe they feel as though that's all they are is, is uh, this sexual whatever. But somebody did something under this moon too. The moon energy. Yeah, they're hiding their insecurities. I just heard. Yeah. Okay. The moment you left, you bruise their ego. It's like everybody wants me. Why don't you want me? Somebody's wand is two inches from the floor. Okay, listen, that was a lot. But damn it. That's what my spirit team said. Shout out to all the men that are not out here abusing their wands uh, abilities. I mean, I don't know what else to say. This person's out here digmatizing women and they're going crazy. But you, not so much, my friend. That's a big problem for this person. They got a big ego, a big ego. She loves his big ego. Somebody's very, very uh, cocky. Okay, no pun intended, but yeah, somebody's very cocky, very arrogant, big ego. Yeah, there's pun intended, okay? Somebody's a wander. Somebody's a wandering wand. 
Yeah, look, five of wands, they're trying to fight off people from coming towards you. This person's having more sex than, than it should be legally allowed. Yeah, let's just call it what it is, whatever it is. Five of wands in the reverse, they feel defeated by you. It's like you put a good ass whooping on this person and now they're turned on. And now you, you, you make them feel as though they need to get their shit together. Like they just needed somebody to really stand up to them. That's crazy. This could absolutely be a feminine and the empress could be a masculine. I'm going to need you to discern and think for yourself and kind of feel what you need to take what resonates, leave the rest. Yeah, listen, somebody like that ass whooping, honey. Ooh, we heavy on the Sagittarius energy with the temperance. Somebody could be Aries. Somebody got fire. Leo, they like fire sign, fire, fire, fire. Emma, up node, south node, up the nose, eighth house, tenth house, whatever it is, they got fire. Somebody's got Aries, Leo, Sagittarius in their chart. Very passionate. Okay, somebody feels as though they've hit a brick wall, though. I'm just going to be honest. With the Eight of Wands, this person could be wanting to come towards you, Divine Feminine, Divine Masculine. Yeah, listen, this is after some type of separation. You bruised their ego. Five of Wands, they were fighting off all the competition. Somebody didn't want you to move forward. Somebody didn't want you to be happy. Yeah, listen, now they want to come in. This is a breadcrumb. Somebody's not all the way through their karma. It's like, nah, whatever this lesson is, they got a long way to go before they learn it. But because they're under judgment, they're now considering uh, their issues. Somebody's really dark. This person could have tried to take your beauty or how handsome you are. They just didn't want people attracted to you with that five of wands. Yeah, look, they're angry because you have offers. You have friendships. Okay, clarify, please. And thank you. Thank you. Yeah, Knight of Wands in the reverse. Somebody is real dominant. Sorry, y'all. Something's at my door. Hold on. King of Wands in the reverse is an abuse of power. Definitely a warlock. Could have did some type of sexual domination, incantations, you know. If you were intimate with this person, this person was trying to cast a spell while they were inside of you. Somebody's gotten real deep. Let me just take a real commercial break real quick. Hold on. That's heavy. Okay, y'all, so listen. Yeah, somebody is real, like, like very dominating, okay? Again, this person does this to all their lovers. They need a lot of attention. And um, I think at some point, somebody just mastered their V-game. Let me just be honest, okay? They mastered their D-game. They mastered their V-game. This could still be a feminine. I'm honestly getting a karmic-ass masculine, but could be a feminine. Let's not be prejudiced by way of gender. Somebody mastered sex, you know, they know how to get you coming back, but somebody wanted uh, to control somebody with sex. You know, I see somebody like giving it, you know, and then taking it away. <laughs> somebody tried to play some type of mind game with you, divine feminine, and now they're in their feelings. They got a lot of choices. Okay, or divine masculine. Yeah, they betrayed you over and over and over and over again. Somehow this person like cheated with other people. Even if you were nowhere around and they felt like they were hurting you each time. Like this is how angry somebody is. They could have been having angry sex, violent sex, domination. Somebody's angry that they didn't get you. It's the one that got away, you know type of an energy and i feel like whoever you are you just kept going yeah ace of wands you got a new beginning you went towards something that was best for you damn whose story is this can we just have a commercial break whose story is this yeah look you cut this person off with the quickness aquarius libra and or gemini energy honey you got into the queen of swords you set a boundary and you're like listen you're like you got to have more than your wand or just good vajay you know, like, yeah, you cut somebody off like you ain't the only <laughs> one, two inches from the floor. OK, type of an energy. And the fact that you whoop somebody's ass spiritually, honestly, turn this person on. This is crazy. Clarify the king of wands in the reverse and the knight of wands. Yeah, it turned them on, honey. Somebody's like, I like the fire that you give me. Queen of wands is fiery. She's determined. She's unapologetic. If she got the Set your ass on fire. She going to set your ass on fire. You coming up as the queen of swords, the queen of wands. 
your all the major arcanas, earth, wind, fire, and air, and water. Okay, so whatever somebody thought it was, it ain't. <laughs> they could have traveled to a distance with that two of wands and the hierophant to do a love spell. Yeah, look, now they're going crazy. The lovers, you were supposed to come back. They're mad, okay, because you got something new coming in. Yeah, king of swords, whoever your counterpart is, they could be in behind the shadows whooping ass on your behalf, to be quite honest. Now, if you've not come into contact with this person as of yet, some of you could be encountering a Gemini. That's not for everybody. King of Swords is confident, but if you've not met this person yet, they absolutely are defending you in the spirit realm. I feel like whoever this King of Wands is, you put an ass whooping on this person and turn them on. That's weird. That's all somebody wanted was violence, abuse, pain. Yeah, it's like, damn, nobody's ever done that. Yeah, look, they're still watching. Somebody's watching your videos, pleasuring themselves to your videos. Somebody can't get an arousal without watching you you know why though let's just keep it real listen i'm gonna be honest they traveled to a practitioner had a love spell done now the shit has backfired and now they're obsessively thinking about you now their wand doesn't work unless they think about you now they can't get aroused by anybody else unless they are with you somebody just the love spell backfired okay <laughs> so now they're sitting up obsessed that's the way you were supposed to be with them Sex was supposed to control you. You weren't supposed to think about nobody else's wand, nobody else's JJ, vagina, you know, whatever. Now this F is like out in the cold with the universe. I mean, they're watching you though, obsessively. Yeah, it's crazy. They're going through a major dark night of the soul. This shit backfired real bad. Death is on their head. It's like change or go, die or grow, or what, do you, what else are you doing in life? Because the universe is not accepting this behavior uh, anymore. You were absolutely somebody's lesson and their test and their teacher simultaneously. Five of Pentacles, they could be going through something with their resources. The universe is breaking this person down to its very last compound. Like literally breaking this down and making change. Somebody has to change. If they don't change, it's a wrap. It's over. And you got a counterpart here. King of Swords to the Queen of Swords. Yeah, hermit ener energy, Virgo energy. Somebody could be in isolation. Clarify. That fell right on top of the King of Swords. Yeah, Four of Cups. Somebody don't give a damn no more. And I feel like that's you, Divine Collector, with the Four of Cups and the Reverse. You like, it is what it is. Like, okay. You know what I mean? Like, it's a lot going on. Mm -mm. It's over. You close the door. Somebody played too many mind games. Somebody was just using women, using men sexually um, because they couldn't get to you. It's like once you encounter this type of energy, empress energy, emperor energy, uh, somebody that's truly divine, it's difficult to go back to this pr promiscuous, excuse me, energy because you're always chasing the pale white horse, right? Yeah, you're always chasing that high and you can't find it because you've encountered a divine being. So somebody has something to prove at the cost of themselves. They're a juggler, okay? They like to juggle women, juggle men, have one on reserve, one on the back burner, just in case something falls through. <laughs> it's like, okay. Yeah, look, fell right on top of the lovers. They're sneaky. They're deceptive. They go to many households. But this shit got old real quick once they encountered you. Something's not satisfying anymore. Something's no fun, um, you know? Yeah, at some point, this was a huge ego stroke. This person could have binded all of their lovers to them, too. Somebody weird as shit, honey. Uh-uh, you broke free. Yeah, five of swords. Listen, whatever this is, they're all fighting. Whoever they're dealing with, there's a conflict. They're just, yeah, this, is, this was about power. This was about aggression. This was about domination. This was about proving a point. Now somebody's trying to figure out what was the point. This fell right on top of the lover's. Five of Cups, okay, grieving, they're fighting. They're in the Five of Cups, Five of Swords, Five of Wands in the reverse, Four of Cups in the reverse, Four, Four, Four could be significant, Five, 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 okay, and the Five of Pentacles. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Somebody is getting an ass whipping. Okay, as they say in the hood, an ass whooping. Okay, somebody's getting whipped like some cream. <laughs> whipped like a smoothie whatever it is four of pentacles you're holding back from this person they're low on resources yeah you're not 
you're holding back. You're not in, not interested in one way or the other. You're allowing nature to take its course. It's very organic by where the karma. Six of swords, you transmuted some type of energy. You healed. Now you're on your destiny. Will of fortune, Gemini energy. Somebody like literally got the lesson and you didn't come back. You're Listen, you are the queen of cups. Let me tell you something about the queen of cups. You're all the queens. Did I not just say queen of cups, queen of swords, queen of wands, empress energy, the star. Somebody's a healer. Somebody's a divine feminine I'm getting heavy divine feminine energy, although this could be a divine masculine. Let's just be clear. There could be a divine masculine that's sitting real nice and comfortable in his feminine energy by way of balance. But you love yourself. Somebody's like, no, nah, I love myself too much. I love myself. I'm not coming back to this. Somebody had you in competition with a whole bunch of people. Somebody really was getting like their rocks off by way of watching other people fight over them. With the five of wands in the reverse, everybody could have walked away. I feel like when you broke the spell or whatever the hell somebody had you bound to or tried to keep you in, you broke it for everybody. And now this person's sitting up and nobody's around. Spirit is like, good, sit your ass there. Now let's have a conversation with yourself. Let's talk about who you've been. That has not worked to your advantage. Now let's talk about who it is that you want to be. You're going to either grow or go. Okay, you want to live or you want to die. It's up to you. We all got choices. Sneaky and deceptive ass. Listen, I can't make it up. Three of wands. They're trying to figure out what they want to do, okay? Because they have to break up with some people that have not broken up with them because they're being guided by source to do so. Yeah, listen, the chariot. This person could be driving past your house. Child, if you don't get your punk ass and save your gas and quit driving past people's house with the chariot and the three of wands, they're trying to figure out where you at. They're watching you. The spirit is watching that ass. So this person could be a little, yeah, look, this person could be a little paranoid, okay, after isolation and then they're driving in the night trying to see where you're at. Somebody's trying to see if there's somebody with you, if you're entertaining somebody, if somebody's at your house, the hangman, yeah, listen, it's over. Somebody's stuck. They got to walk away, okay? You abandon the circumstance and now they got to abandon this bullshit because you're not to be played with. Your ancestors shut the door with the world, child. Ain't nobody got time for the bullshit. This is the message. I love y'all, okay? I'm going to go eat. I love y'all so much. This is the message. If it resonated, I'm glad. My food is here and I love you so much. I'll see you soon. If you want to donate, do it. Peace be with you.